today I'll be showing you how to use INPA software and the gear you need to get it all working in order to be able to scan and clear the codes on your BMW. Today I'll be doing an example on a E36 M3. So first of all I'll be showing you the tools I have. I have this tool which I bought from uh, eBay basically allows you to switch between um, OBD and ADS line and uh, I have one of these adapters which is connected here and another 9 pin uh, extension lead which goes at the back of the laptop To get this working you will need a laptop which has one of these ports. Any sort of adapters to be used in the meantime, it won't work. Follow the instructions on the internet how to install INPA or INPA. In order to uh, switch between uh, OBD and ADS which can be done from here also has to be done on the software from here you just switch by pressing the button ADS or OBD I'll be using the ADS which uh, is much better for the E36 as I can clear the codes from the um, airbag module as well and uh, functions from the cluster clocks so uh, after you install it, if you go to uh, the place where you have installed it, for example, C, that folder, and then there's a folder called bin, and then you'll go to a file which is called adiabass.ini. You open that file and halfway down there's a place where you can change if you look here this is what it should write std.ads top and bottom if you want to switch between ads and obd you just erase it backspace use backspace write with capital letters obd and the second one as well and then you just exit it and you save it but as I said in my case I want to use the ADS line so I'll change it back to ADS I'll run the program INPA and then with my ignition switched on and this switch to ADS you should be able to get battery on and ignition on both of them have to be on in order to be able to use the software having an E36 I will have to choose the old model so shift F9 and then I'll go into E36 engine being an M3 has the S50 engine code so I'll choose that and then I will read the, the I'll go to error memory so press F4 F1 to read and it says no errors found so that means I have no code stored in the module in case if you want to clear it you just click F2 and that will clear it there's other things that you can do as well with this software for example I'll start the car up
Shift F9 I can uh, I'll click F5 and I can read digital values for example it will show me battery voltage and all other stuff This software can also be used to calibrate the SMG clutch. For example, now I've turned the ignition off, and as you say, it's the ignition off. If you get battery on the ignition off, that means something is wrong. Sometimes, if you scan different cars, you will find out that once you are on ADS line, as here, and in that file I showed you earlier, the ignition will still show off and then you have to restart the laptop and it should be all working after that well, that's about it i hope this will help somebody thank you for watching